What's going on, Wix Nation? MPS here from Wix Training Academy, and long time no see. To be completely honest with you, I needed a little bit of a break from videos. From April till end of May, I recorded somewhere in the ballpark of 45 to 60 videos. It was a whole lot of content, but today I'm going to show you what layers are here in Editor X within Wix, and we're going to keep it really short, sweet, to the point, and then if you have follow-up questions about layers, I want you to go ahead and ask me, and I'll create some follow-up videos for it. But without further ado, if you haven't already, make sure you hit that subscribe button, turn those bell notifications on, and you'll instantly plug into the largest Wix training community on the internet. Pretty perfect place to be when learning a brand new editor. And oh, by the way, I hope you're staying healthy out there. I know uh, we're up and then we're down and now COVID's back up again. It's crazy how it works. Anyway, let's go ahead and jump into it. <laughs> Okay guys, so we're here in Editor X. Now to access what we are discussing today, which is layers, what you're gonna do is you're gonna go ahead and click layers. It's this like stack looked icon. You would click that and then it opens your page to layers. Now each layer is made up of a couple different things. You have your page first and foremost. Under that, you have either containers or sections. And within these containers or sections lie all of your elements, right? So it contains your shapes, your text, buttons, lines, all of that good stuff. Even, um, I think, is it this one? Let's see here. It contains uh, menus, everything like that. And if you want, you can actually click right here, and it'll show you what section it is. And then you can drop it down. And you can see what's in there. So you can see it's got the text in there. So basically layers just allow you to organize all of your elements on the page and just be more clear about where everything's at and be able to manipulate elements easier and move them between sections. Like if I wanted to take this and move it up here, I could, right? And I can take it and move it up there. Granted, it's already up there, so it doesn't really matter. Um, however, if I wanted to take this and move it up there, let's show you that. Nope, didn't want to move. Anyway, you can come in here and you can click the uh, three little dots next to it, and here you have the ability to manipulate some of the settings within that element so not only do you get to see a full layout of each page and where all of your elements are but you have the ability to manipulate that element or not for instance you can choose whether you display that element in that section or not whether you're copying it duplicating it how you're arranging it if you're bringing it forward from the uh, where it's currently at or pushing it behind another element how you're aligning it, if there's a scroll effect to it, whether it's fixed or sticky, you can add an anchor to it, you can rotate it. These are all things you can do straight from your layers panel. So what I want you to think of with the layers is it's really nice. Think of it as an organization tool more than anything because you can obviously do this stuff by simply clicking on elements and we're going to get into more sophisticated uh, aspects of Editor X as well with different elements in different sections, different containers. But for a base level video, what I just want you to understand is that each page you have different layers. Now, if we go, for instance, to this light box, this is considered a page with layers and you can see it's a light box. It's under the page and it shows all of the elements here on it. And if we X off, we can see here's the elements that it was just showing. If we go back, we can see if we open the light box layer here, it's got the vertical menu and it's got the button. So that is what layers do. I know that's a very broad overview, but I just want to make sure we get on the same page with the fact that layers are like a very key organization tool within Editor X. If you guys enjoyed this video and you're happy to see me back, I'm happy to see you guys back drop a thumbs up down below make sure to comment any questions you have and obviously if you've got more burning questions or more sophisticated questions about layers drop them in the comments and lastly don't forget to go ahead and hit that subscribe button turn those bell notifications on and you'll instantly join the largest witch training community on the internet
a pretty perfect place to be when learning this brand new editor. And oh, by the way, we just keep growing, growing, and growing thanks to you guys. So I just want to thank you for that. And I'm excited to continue growing with you. Again, stay healthy, stay safe out there. I'll catch you on our next video. Glad to be back.